If you can't give your customer seven good reasons to put down money, you are not a professional. And you, you know what? You're not doing your damn customer any favor either. Because if they put nothing down and they finance it for 84 months, will you ever help them buy another car? No, you won't. Did I tell you yesterday what the number one variable is when it, when it comes to determining whether the customer buys another car from this dealership? Term. Term. Put them out on a 24-month lease, you're going to see them suckers 89% of the time again buying another car from you. Steve, let me run through this. This is the seven you got. Lower balance to finance. Lower the balance to finance. Lower payment. Lower the monthly investment. Fewer finance charges. Reduce the finance charges. Option to shorten the term. Save money again because you've shortened the term. Build equity faster. Freedom to trade or sell sooner if you so desire. Dream payment sooner. No payment at all. By the way, is this all the truth? And I'm starting them out at seven to eight thousand dollars. And if, if you remember, I'm going to play this back. I said, Zach, don't worry, we're going to do it your way. Because I don't want to scare him if he ain't got the money. I never want this to become a reason for the customer not to buy. I never want him to think, well, gee, I, 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 I'm going to have to go somewhere else because these sons of bitches want too much money down. So I always caveat it. We're going to do it your way. Don't worry. But let me share with you why our customers like to put down 20 to 25 percent. By the way, would most people like to put down 20 to 25 percent if they had it? Yeah, sure. sure they would, because they all want these benefits. They all want lower payments. They want to pay it off quicker. They all want to save money. But they, we, we don't know who's got it and who doesn't have it. That's the one thing we cannot determine. No social security number will help us. So all we can do is give them good reasons, and then I'm going to bump them. Look, nobody wants to pay. Nobody wants to finance taxes. Can you put down another check for two thousand dollars? Well, I could do three thousand up to how you know how high could you go? I'm going to work them because I want. When it, by the way, does this make it easier for me to close the sale? And it sure as hell makes it easier for you to generate some back end income. It's going to make it much easier for the customer to say yes to a service contract or to gap or to tire and wheel or to other things that tie them back to the dealership. But I, I'm, you know, I don't know how you write up your deal, Shay. You tell me. Um, are they sending the salespeople out with zero down options on the first pencil? So the, the answer is uh, that is not the pencil strategy. However, I think that. Not for me, but you guys tell me. If you guys request zero down, are you getting it? Yeah. Okay, well, that, that's, that's shameful.